Hey everyone, Jacefer here with the Mountain Cave by Lego Minecraft. Set number 21137 contains 2863 pieces. So here we have a large box full of random bricks and such to make this giant mountain cave. So this is the unboxing. It's a very large set. There's the back of the box with the various artwork. This is a nice large set. It'd be exciting if I actually opened it up to see exactly what is inside the large box. I don't think I'm going to do a speed build on this because it is pretty large. And let's do it this way to make it more interesting. Here we go. Oh yeah, look at all those parts. Oh yeah, look at all that. It'd help if you can see it, huh? And we have another smaller box. Looks like a box that you'd have donuts packed in. Well, let me get the scissors and crack that open. Now I am going to pour all these out on the table. So this should be very interesting. Let's get that open. I've been getting a few requests to go in more in depth on parts. It seems like a lot of viewers are not too interested in part explorations. So we'll see. Okay, I first thought these were chopsticks. Okay, so we do have several numbered bags for easy build. A lot of good parts. I don't know exactly what's inside each bag. Now, do I dare pour these out in one big pile, or do I just sort them out by bags and we go for each one? Well, I like to do things a bit complicated, so I'm going to unbag everything and pour it in one big pile. I know that sounds a bit too crude, <laughs> but I'm going to do it anyways. It gives me something to do, so I'll be back in a moment. I just emptied out the 24 bags. And there is a lot of bricks. First, we have the instruction manual. It is bound. It's about half an inch thick. We're interested in the bricks, though. There is a ton of bricks, plates, and other various elements. So here we got a few of these 6x8 Technic chassis. Matter of fact, you get a bunch of them in here. Also, we do have some of these brick yellow twisty things. I'm not sure what those are for. A couple of Technic beams, lots of bricks in the light bluish gray. You also do get a brick separator and a few printed pieces. So we have a TNT, a 2x3 flat tile with an arrow, and a 2x2 two two brick with a black square on one side. Also, I found a 2x4x2 two by by two windscreen that it is in bright green. I don't know how rare these are, but I've never seen them in that color. Well, I found somebody's gold pants. <laughs> so yeah, you get a ton of bricks. You are not going to get shortchanged. For this set being $249.99, that's what you get. You get a lot of entertainment with this. 
What else do we have in here? A couple of 2x4 bricks, jumper plates, some 1x2 slopes, lots of Technic bricks, and plenty 6x6 plates. We even do have a few that are in sand green. It also does come with a good selection of transparent green and blue bricks as well. I've been getting requests to do more of the special bricks in this set. Like, which bricks are the rarest? I have no clue. <laughs> Except for that 2x4x2 green windscreen. It just depends on the user's collection. But it does have some medium nougat. I did see some profile bricks with single groove. There's some 2x2 two two bricks with a pin on the side. You can attach a wheel or something. Some purple studs. I can't even go through this. It's just so many pieces. There's some 1x6x5 wall elements. I'm not a fan of those. Oh, I found an enchanted pickaxe. Well, these will come in handy. Let's see what else is in here. I found a skeleton head. Medium nougat fencing. Or ladders, if you want to call them that. Let's see if there's anything else interesting in here. You do get a few treasure chests. Oh, here's a 2x2 two two plate. Excuse me, a 4x4 four four plate with a 2x2 two two opening. Looks like we get a bunch of these. In dark bluish gray. A couple of stud flowers. More Technic themes. Enchanted armor. I could literally spend an hour just going through this. Here we have a 2x4 medium nougat brick. So there is a lot of stuff. Here's a light bluish gray. Excuse me. Light blue. And I don't know what kind of blue that is. It's more like ice blue. If that's even a color. But yeah, there's a lot of parts in this set. You can see right here, there's a lot of stuff that can be done with this. Even if you're buying this set just for parts, there's just too much to, to build with it, which is good. We have some bigger plates. And the only thing I didn't see in here is a base plate to set the mountain cave on. So I have a feeling this is going to be one of those modular builds. Here's one of those weird plates. Looks like it's a 2x2 two two plate that's been modified. Not sure what that goes to. There's those profile bricks. I really don't see anything else in here. Well, no, no, no. Here we got some nice orange Technic pins. I haven't seen this piece in that color. I've always seen them in red and light bluish gray. Well, that's about it. Well, <laughs> There's just so much to go through. Now I know it's a bit silly. I dumped all this out on the table. All 24 bags. So I'm going to have to sort all these. It just depends on the user's preference, I guess. For somebody like myself, I grew up doing stuff like this. See right here, here's another specialty piece. We have a 1x2 wall element with a square printed on the side. So that could be a rare piece as well. So yeah, that's pretty much about it for the exploration. It would take me about a good 30 minutes to talk about each piece. <laughs> I don't want to bore everyone to death with that. But yeah, it's a lot. You get a lot with this set. So for $250, you get 2,800 pieces. 
majority of it, which is bricks and plates. This would be a builder's dream. I can't wait to dive into this. Hope this parts exploration helps everyone out with exploring the mountain cave set by Lego Minecraft. See if this is something that may interest a few mock builders. Thank you for watching.